Hey what's going on everybody so as you are probably aware this OnePlus 8T is the first device to have Oxygen OS 11 out of the box and it has some really neat improvements though it does take some design cues from One UI and like all of you i am also tired of hearing and repeating the same stuff so for now let's have a look at some of the good features of Oxygen OS 11 that will probably come on other OnePlus devices too like this Nord and some leaks have said that this nod might get a stable update in this month itself so fingers crossed if it does anyways let's start off with the first good feature so that is this new game space and it does have some hidden wallpapers too so to get those wallpapers open the game space app now open the settings tab from this three dot menu on the top right corner now scroll down to the bottom of the list and tap on fanatic mode now tap 5 times on this fanatic logo and type always fanatic and there you go you get these three cool looking wallpapers so just click on add to wallpapers and they will remain safe in your wallpaper collection another change in game space is that you cannot bring the status bar down from corners for that you have to tap on this arrow and it will do the job for you but that can be disabled and that too in one click So when you swipe down from top to bottom on any corner, you get this pop-up with other useful info like battery temperature and fanatic mode. And in here, just turn off miss search prevention, and you can bring the status bar down from anywhere now. And all this is really helpful for those gamer souls out there. Second one in this list is this Horizon Light. So it has been there with past versions of Oxygen OS 2, but good to see that it is available on the OnePlus 8T, as the OnePlus Nord wasn't having this feature. So you can set it to turn on when notifications arrive on your device and you can choose any color you wish to see. So whenever a notification will come, the edges will light up. And this acts as a good replacement of notification LED which I really miss on newer devices. Next one in this list is this OnePlus Shelf. And like some newer OnePlus devices, Google Feed has replaced this OnePlus Shelf as the leftmost home screen. But you can get that. Yes. Simply long press on your home screen, go to settings, and in swipe down access select shelf from the list and don't forget to click on this tick button on the top right corner and you are all set just swipe down from top to bottom and you get this redesigned shelf which is in line with this current theme and as you can see the main focus is on weather now and as per that this card gets themed so it is more dynamic now which isn't necessarily bad and it looks kind of clean so what do you think about it Well the cards are a bit bigger now and you can make the most of this option in case you have loved the OnePlus shelf in past. Next one in this list is always on display. So it is one of the main highlights of Oxygen OS 11 as you guys know by now and I was a bit skeptical about how good it will be because it has been there on Android phones since years now and it did not disappoint me at all. So this is one of the most efficient always on display I have tried on a phone. and the battery drain is really really less because it is a bit dim but that is what it is supposed to do show all useful info without disturbing the user the best one among all these is inside aod and i find it quite innovative as it does the job while shaming you for using the device more and i find it cool so coming to another good one now and this one is called canvas aod well this feature might not come to all oneplus devices at first as it is in beta version even on the OnePlus 8T so to use this feature go to settings now go to customization and in here choose the canvas option now all you have to do is choose the right image and it works well with faces so choose any image you want and it will be converted to a sketch now click on apply and your self obsessed always on display is ready jokes apart it is quite different and thus you will find it quite cool looking Last one in this list is this new Zen mode. So it was already there with the previous version of Oxygen OS, but now it has this new redesign. So you can access it from notification drawer and in case you don't see it, bring up the tile from the hidden list. Now you can choose from these four themes and the predefined time. So this will take your phone into a lockdown mode which we are used to by now in 2020 and you won't be able to interact with your device at all. Plus you can create or join a room and invite your friends to go into zen mode together. And it might not seem fun, but it is quite handy if you have annoying friends. So that's it for now. And I'll be back with some more handy features really soon. So stay tuned and subscribe if you haven't already. Lastly, like this video if it helps you out and I'll see you in the next one.